Good evening. Tonight's glitch in the Matrix experience is about a disappearance. And two people witnessed it, not just one. Author name. Oreo Chu. Story title. Mom made a friend who disappeared. This story is from my lovely mother, who remembered this incident. Not sure if this is more suited here, or our paranormal. Two years back, my mom went on a solo trip to Tibet. From there, she took the Qinghai Tibet Railway from Tibet all the way to Xingning, which is almost a 24-hour train ride. The more comfortable and expensive rooms on the train were bunk beds on the right and left, and a table in the middle. Since my mom was also a solo traveler, she wanted to make a friend to talk to during the long train ride, and she decided to talk to the girl who slept at the bottom bunk. Mom said that this girl had very heavy eye bags, which left quite an impression on Mom because she was very pale too, is a university student, and was on her way to visit her grandmother. Since they were both going to stop at Zinning, they decided to stay together and have meals throughout the 24 hours. Sleeping opposite them was a guy from Tibet who also had small talks with mom and the girl. Opposite bunk was empty. During the night, the train only made one stop, but from what mom remembered, she never recalled the door of her room opening. Light sleeper alert. Sure enough, when they woke up, the girl disappeared. Her bed looked like it was untouched and never slept in, and her belongings were not there at all. The guy was actually the one who woke mom up and asked her if the girl had already left. They both felt weird and decided to ask a train crew member if the girl already left. But the crew member said that the room was only occupied by two of them, mom and the guy. Mom even went to ask the waitress on the train if they recalled mom having a meal with this girl, even describing details, but they said they only saw mom eating alone. Until now, my mom is still confused because she would have believed she hallucinated, but the guy also remembered the girl, and he told my mom that he felt weird when he alighted a few stops before mom. Edit. Asked mom whether she ever suspected girl was a ghost. Mom said now she's convinced it was a spirit sent to accompany her. Human trafficking is scary, but could also be a possibility, which I hope isn't true. It scared her when I mentioned this, because now she feels as though she's being watched. Wherever that girl is or was, mom hopes you're doing well. Personal thoughts. So the ghost angle seems to be the most logical here. But of course, human trafficking is a possibility too. But I think more likely, yeah, it was a ghost. Maybe something bad happened to her on the train in the past and it was just an imprint, going through what she did before. The fact that the other guy saw her too is very intriguing, but the trained staff that were serving them their meals, they didn't see anyone with her, so it was only two people that saw her, but it was two people, so it couldn't be a hallucination. If I had to bet, I would say, yeah, this was a ghost, maybe sharing her final moments, whoever she was, over and over with new passengers.